You know, I think, uh, I think first of all that uh, Newcastle United players and obviously stuff, uh, they gave what they have and what they don't have. And I think that's a beautiful thing in, uh, in football. I think they, they come here today um, to fight for a point. But they found themselves in a position of uh, being winning one nil, and in that moment, I think they they went over all the limits of the effort, of the sacrifice, of everything a manager likes to see in his team. I saw that in in my team after the one nil. I, I I saw that in my team that desire to play and to try and to go until the last second, which we did. Um, I can imagine that Benitez is more than pleased with the effort of his players. Were they lucky? Yes, they were. Yes, they were. But sometimes you attract that lucky with your state of mind. And uh, after the one nil, I think Newcastle players, they fought for their lives. And I think that's a beautiful thing in football. You talked about him before the game. What do you think Sir Bobby Robson would be saying to you now after, after that result? It, it, after some defeats, he told me a few times, don't be so sad if you look and if you think about the happiness of the other guys. Um, so it has to be the way. I, I know that Newcastle players and fans and, and Benitez and everybody connected with the club is very, very happy with these three points. He's very, very happy with the feeling of uh, the gods of football were with us. So at least I have that little, that little smile. But obviously I am, I am disappointed because I think we, we did uh, more than enough to live without, um, without a defeat. Sure, of course. You know, it's a lateral free kick. It's not even a lateral free kick from a from um, a dangerous position. It's really far from uh, from the goal. Uh, clearly, the positions were the players. They know the positions they have to be. But we miss we miss the um, the challenge in India. I I remember clearly without television, but just with my with my memory from the touchline, I remember clearly a Newcastle player jumping and two of my players looking at him and staying on the, on the floor. So the guy won the ball in the air and then the second ball in the face of David. And you can play about the actual free kick in. Why Chris Farley has been both diving in the midfield? No, no complaints. Uh, no, I don't like to, to complain about referees on 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 this kind of situation, a little bit like the first goal against Tottenham. I could complain that the goal is illegal, that uh, Harry Kane was already 10 metres inside of our half, but I think it's more logical to complain about our mistake in, in the long ball. And today, I don't know. I don't know if it is a free kick, no free kick. What I know is that we missed a challenge in in the air and we missed the, the, the second ball and uh, I coach my players, I don't coach the, the referees. I have to I have to be more disappointed with um, with my players by losing that challenge. Okay, last question. Maybe this was very quickly before Paul Sunas. Ah you asked Paul you asked Sunas. No 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 Paul Sunas told uh, Paul Sunas uh, Comments and is responsible for his comments, not me. Okay, last question from Samuel. Sorry, 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 sorry. I don't analyze players individually. Is that a concern with the, um, the way the goals conceded today? You got beat on a long ball at the top and under a couple in the derby. Is, is that something that is a worry for you? The amount of aerial balls you can see in the goal? You know, uh, we train, we work, we organize. The players they have their individual jobs in situations where we defend zonal. The players they know the zonal responsibilities. But um, you know, 
you, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure that you already watched that goal on television a few times. I didn't. I, I'm pretty sure that you did. So you know more than me. You know that lo who, lose, who lost the challenge in the air. You know clearly that. So I think it's, it's better if you don't put me in a position where I have to criticize a player. And um, by yourself, you make your analysis. Okay, thanks, guys. Thank you.